Welcome back to Spank Ranch Garage. In this episode, we got my 1986 K5 Blazer. It's bone stock, automatic, 305 small block. We're gonna dyno it as is, then we're gonna swap it to a stick shift and see how it does. All right, as expected, this thing makes absolutely terrible horsepower. Uh, we, we made 108 and a half on the first pull, 110.9 on the second pull. About this before I welded it up, I wanted to actually bring it a little higher than brake pedal. I've seen that in older trucks. I think just having additional travel will not. All right guys, we're back at it. Same exact engine, no changes under here. Same exact truck, very similar weather conditions. Only difference is I put a three pedal type transmission in it with a shifter. So let's do a couple pulls and see if it makes any difference. Okay, so the results are in. This is our automatic pull versus our stick shift pull. I did three with the stick. They all came out to 124 point something horsepower. Torque right around 209, 205, whatever. Um, at peak horsepower, so right, right around here, it picked up, uh, what, 14 horsepower or so. And then you have more substantial gains out here as the RPMs and speed increase. So for instance, at 120 miles an hour, the automatic was making 70 horsepower, while the stick's making about 95 horsepower. So um, I did this graph versus speed. I also did it versus RPM, but it didn't turn out as nice as I hoped because the torque converter never actually fully locks on the 700R4 in third gear. So between all the slippage and crap going on, I can't make heads or tails of uh, you know what that data would mean but when it comes to wheel speed versus wheel speed picked up some horsepower with the automatic um you know you got what 11 11 12 percent right here in the center and over this way you're closer to 25 percent horsepower gain so when people tell you that an automatic eats 15 percent 20 percent 30 percent 
I don't think they know what they're talking about because it really depends on power levels, converter slip, you know, so many different factors. Um, I don't think you can say an automatic robs a certain amount of power. All right, guys, this wraps up this episode. Uh, this was a cool little project because I had to change this to a five-speed anyway, so I figured why not dyno it before and after and not change anything else. You know, you read all these myths that automatics rob 10% power, 15, 20, 30, whatever you want. Um, in this case, it was only robbing about 11, 12% power. So if this thing made more power, I'd expect that the automatic maybe would take a bigger portion of that. But, you know, this is 120 horsepower, 36-year-old, just hammered out small block. Anyway, if you've got comments, leave them in the boxes below. And thanks for watching Spank Ranch Garage. See you next time.